Hello everybody. Whenever we are going through perceived extreme chaotic situations, maybe your career is not well settled, maybe your finances are not well settled, maybe your house is not, you know, maybe you don't have it right now or you're going through moving process and your relationships are not in a, um, you know, good conditions like there is there are no relation healthy relationship dynamics in those moments we can feel like this is going all wrong and i should just abandon myself i should just abandon the things that i was doing to make my uh, overall life good maybe you were journaling every day maybe you were doing breath work you were taking care of yourself you were showering you were you know doing all these things that were bringing calmness ease good energy relaxation relief positivity uh, cl clarity in your life so you you would feel like like i should abandon them when you are going through these kind of perceived chaotic situation when I say perceived, because our physical mind cannot see it. But when, when we feel like there is so much chaos, it is actually an opportunity for the universe to bring so much magic, to like blow your mind with miracles, to blow your mind with, you know, how good it can be, how good it is going to be, you know so that magic it's an opportunity for magic we can feel like oh my god we are going down the dungeon no you are elevating you are like coming into power into so much of strength into so much of integrity into so much of peace into so much of alignment that is going to propel you forward and upward into wow into so much of prosperity brilliance and um what do opa what, what, what there's a word for it um opulence opulence like gold and op luxury like royalty okay in those moments you are like moving into re royalty and regality but when we are going through it, it can feel like fearful. Our mind can convince us like it's go, it's nothing's working and all of that. And ultimately the result will be that you will start to abandon yourself. Do not do that. Reprogram yourself that my self-care is going to be solid. I am going to wake up. I'm going to do things like maybe showering. I'm going to be clean. I'm going to be dressing up well. I'm going to be, you know, keep cleanliness around me. I'm going to be eating well because, you know, we can just stop eating because we feel like, oh, nothing matters. So then it's a subconscious way of um, abandoning ourselves. So and drinking lots of water, keeping our energy super clean, super nutritious, super um, like filled with positive energy, positive affirmations. And how do we do that? You look in the mirror. This is what I do, like because I'm going through this kind of situations. But uh, what I am doing and I'm sharing it with you, I look into the mirror and I tell myself like, only only ease only peace only joy only integrity only alignment only high vibration is possible with me only only high vibration only peace only joy only goodness only relaxation only like um good energy is possible with me so and I sit I will sit in front of the mirror after I have dressed up I've you know done all the things that I like to do I've made my butterfly and I'm not saying that this is what you have to do you gotta see what feels most aligned with you you gotta keep doing that and to reprogram yourself mirror work works you gotta look into the mirror and tell yourself like this is the only possibility with me high vibration cleanliness you know ease joy relief royalty regality prosperity integrity that is the only possible possibility with me and uh, yeah do not abandon yourself in those moments i get the fear i get you know that 
desire to just stop doing things that you were doing to keep your yourself in check and in positive energy but don't let these them perceived they are perceived they are not real because uh, wow it's always an opportunity whenever these situate these kind of situations arises of that feels like perceived chaos there's just an opportunity for universe for god to come in and assist you in big ways to provide for you in big ways and you can ask for god like god show me how much you got my back god show me this is your opportunity to work your magic through me into my life okay yeah so uh, i am jyoti your spiritual bestie your spiritual guide subscribe to my channel if you would like to book a one on one intuitive guidance session with me link is in the description and if you would also like to bring high vibrational good energy calming energy prosperous energy into your life you should definitely check this out i'm going to show you these are my high vibrational paintings whenever you keep them in your home in your office space so much of high vibrational good energy you know aligned energy start to flow into your life this painting says taking a leap of faith on myself this painting will bring so much energy of courage bravery confidence this painting will also support you in healing your shame because of which you will start to play more because when the shame is healed you are playing more and also you will find yourself following your wildest dreams and passion there will be shift in your like so much of boldness will start to come into your life you will become so brave and courageous and then there is another one which is this one says god is god's peace god's goodness god's prosperity effortlessly flowing in every area of my life when you are bringing this painting into your home space into your office space or if you are gifting it to somebody your parents your children your friends your relatives you are gifting them this energy which means that god's prosperity when we are thinking of when we are thinking from our limited mind we feel like i only have one source there is only one way one source of income one source of uh love one source of um, prosperity one source of confidence one source of connection or there is just one way of doing things but when we are connected to god's prosperity or we are open to it then there are multiple and infinite sources of income infinite sources of joy multiple sources of connection and this painting will assist you in that it will open you to that kind of prosperity and god's pro ease god's goodness god's um uh, peace that means when we are connected to god's ease peace and goodness we are opening ourselves to give more because we are letting universe we are letting god to take care of our needs and then because our needs are taken care of for like home food and good environment and good social connection then we feel so much at ease that we want to give back more it is when we are in survival mode when we have nothing sorted out then we only think of our needs me 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 how can i get this done how can i get this bill paid how can i find food for myself how can i just like me 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 and of course if i am in survival i do that and everyone does that so we have to let universe take care of take care of all of our needs and then we will give back automatically so that is what god's ease god's peace god's goodness means you let god take care of all of your needs every single one of it emotional financial spiritual creative okay and then you open yourself to give more and i have two more two or three other more paintings in my uh, uh, like uh, 
website so when you go and click on the link in the description you can also zoom into the images and feel the energy and uh, whatever paintings align with you you can bring them into your home bring this good energy into your life and if my message my energy was helpful my words were helpful calmed you gave you so much of strength you can also donate and uh, link of that is also in my description your donations your prayers will help me a lot in keep going and keep showing up and you know as I'm also moving to my uh, new house so that will also help me in that support me in that and comment down below how this video helped you supported you if you would like me to make video on other topics you know you can share in regards to spirituality manifestation life confidence finding your purpose and all of that uh, and i will see you in another video thank you for being here thank you for giving me an opportunity to serve you it's like in it's ap my absolute honor and i always prayed for this that i want to use my gift in the most aligned way because it fulfills me thank you